Welcome to Grey Overload, I'm Anthony and today I want to go through and just show you how you can do a clean install from the Radeon software. In doing a clean install for the 80 AMD Radeon software, you can do it one of two ways. Either when you download the driver from AMD's website or through their software already if you already have it downloaded. So what you want to do is click install and or double click on your installer that you downloaded from the website. Then you'll pop up this little AMD Radeon installer. Um, it may pop up there, hey, you know, like it showed, do you want to install this? And you click yes, and then you get to a screen that looks like this. And then it'll tell you which driver you're doing. And I have not installed this yet, as you can tell. I should um, install it because I did want to try it out. But there's this thing called, or this thing, there's this node that's additional options. And once you open up additional options, you will see it um, adds in a more options for you, right? And this is the install directory where it's going to install. And I keep that default. I haven't changed that or needed to change that. But then there's this factory reset. And this is going to remove all prior versions of the AMD Radeon software and driver and temporarily pause Windows updates on your system and you're not going to be able to roll back to the previous driver. This is basically just saying, hey, I want a clean slate. Let's blow it all away. Let's start over. Let's make this basically the first driver on our system. And if you want to do a clean install, this is the option I would do starting out. It seems like it's working. I've tested it out a couple times. So you, once you select this, it actually asks you, hey, do you want to keep your settings too? And this just saves your current Radeon settings profiles and reapplies them after the installation. If you really think that you have a problem, I would actually uncheck this as well because um, keeping your user settings around, who knows if that actually is part of the problem. Uh, but if you want to do a factory reset, basically a clean install, this is the way to do it. Once you click install, it will then go through the process. You will then have a reboot um, in the middle of it because it takes all the drivers off. And then during that, re after that reboot, it basically installs the drivers again. So I hope that this helps out if you're looking to do a clean install and get you to where you want to go with it because I know AMD has had some issues in the past few months here with their drivers and the clean install i think should be one option that we should more readily see there's room on this page for it so amd why don't you put that out there so you know even if it's just a checkbox at the bottom here and you have additional options closed for just the install location that would be perfectly acceptable but people need to see this as an option to do a clean or you know factory reset on the, on the driver so um, let me know if this helps or if you want any other videos here with the Radeon software that can help you out. I know that there's still things I'm still finding in it here and there, and I'm still getting questions on it. So I'm, I'm looking into other ways to do other videos. I just don't have all the hardware to do, like switchable graphics and all that other stuff that I'd like to do. So with that, I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for supporting this channel and helping it grow. I really appreciate it. And until next time, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.